getting a boat ready to sail is quite good in a way because it kind of brings about the end of a chapter you know so that you can get on with the new one out of the old in with the new feels like a uh, not really a nice thing to do but the right thing to do Just in case you don't know, we used to live on this narrow boat as a family of three for a little while and we've just moved off. It's time to sell this boat. That's what I've been doing for the most of this week. Getting ready to sell it. Here's a pile of stuff that I just don't know whether... I don't know what to do with that stuff. This anchor has always seemed like overkill, but it was always a bit of a comfort knowing that it was there if I needed it. I'm just sort of like trying to get the deck and stuff like that cleared. It's no biggie today. taking pictures of a narrow boat is that they just don't look very good in pictures. It kind of feels difficult to get back enough and get the perspective. The photos when I look at them, I don't know, they don't seem like the same boat. Well, I've done my best taking pictures of the boat. I think it looks quite nice. I've asked these guys to help me clean the boat. How do you feel now that Zero's up for sale? Um, like good, good but nervous. Actually, that like, feels like quite a big, quite a big thing. Yeah. I just hope that someone, someone loves her. Yeah. As much as we did. It snowed overnight last night and it's all settled, it's all lovely. <laughs> I'm just off to do what I always do in this kind of weather which is just tend to the boats, light their fires, start their engines, generally kind of warm the old girls up and make them know that they're still loved. First mission is 
to light fires. Get a little fire going on both of these boats. got to be pretty careful walking around here because not only is it just really slippery but there's loads of these hidden little iron kind of mooring rings scattered all over the place the way they did them in the old days yeah talking about you Right, I've done my duty. There's fires on both the boats, both the engines have had a good run. It's time to go. It's cafe open day, but it's not me and Joe doing it. How's it going? <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Everything's going fine. Good. I forgot tea. For sure. I started writing this and not the tea. There's gonna be I think there's gonna be a lot of things where people are like, what's that? What's that? But I'm just gonna have to tell them. And I've got the cake list here. What's this? Oh it's a pistachio and mastic sponge with cherry jam and tahini buttercream. Try fitting that on. <laughs> what, what's this? It's a Dougie sandwich which translates as a Duchess cake, which is a type of Cypriot chocolate biscuit fridge cake. <laughs> <laughs> that is, um, is that everything That's on there? That's great, mate. Yeah? yeah? Do you want to go and put them out? Sure. It's Holly the cafe boat. <laughs> Morning. How are you? Yeah, good thanks. The menu looks incredible. Already eyeing up a little tahini chocolate tort. I'd love to be able to tell you what some of those cakes are, but I've no idea. But I am excited to try them. Do you remember this boat? Yeah, this boat. It's really, really, really good. It is really good, isn't it? Oh. Wow. We didn't bring the salesman there. Mm. Been a while since we've been on this boat all together. I don't know if William really remembers it, but, but it's quite nice to see him back here on the boat again. This is weird, isn't it? Yeah. We're home. William, you're in your little bed. <laughs> <laughs> How are you finding it? It's really good. Oh, wow. It's quite strange being in here again, isn't it? It really is. I haven't been in for like a few months. When we come to? When we come to? Yeah, this was my bed too, you little rascal. Aww. Can you still stand up in here? You stand up. <sighs> Only just. <laughs> that was lucky. Oh, it was nice, wasn't it? I think I, I actually would be, I think I'm in a bit of denial. You know, I think like, oh, I probably won't sell. I probably won't sell it in the end, but. We don't really know what we're doing, which will probably come as no surprise to you if you've been watching this channel for a little while. But that's a consideration for another day. We've got a little time to think about that. For now, all I want to think about is what cake am I going to go for first? <laughs> Can we get two of the buff collies? And then could I get a lemon and poppy seed cake? Mm -hmm. So, lemon cake. Buffalo, cappuccino, black tea, one sugar. I'm going to go for my dessert round after. Yeah, same. You've got to pace yourself in this game. Yeah. It's so good experiencing this from a customer perspective. It's so good having a, a sandwich offering. It's cool to be able to yeah. do that, isn't it? Yeah. Great. Oh, thanks so much. That's well good. good luck. Come back onto the boat. I think William was kicking off because it was a little bit cold out there. This is absolutely delicious. <laughs> oh my word. 
Is it nice? It's so good. It's really delicious. You've got quite a lot of sauce on you. It's gonna happen. Eating has to be prioritised. <laughs> Clean up after. <laughs> Turned into the nursery boat. <laughs> Everybody's seeking shelter. It's raining quite a lot outside, it's quite cold now. That was cool. Those guys sold out. I'm really pleased that they had a good day. I got really cold out there, so I've like retreated back into zero and warmed up. Everybody else has left. I'm just gonna ride back now. Catch you later when I get back home. I'm back. That was a good day, wasn't it? I'm glad that it went well. So cool. Yeah, yeah, that was really cool. It's cool to be at the Cafe Vogue from a customer perspective to see what they see, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Made me want to clean the roof. Yeah, clean the roof. And uh, yeah, it was just really cool. I was really pleased when like crowds were, go were there, like those queues of people, they sold out. Like, yeah. it's just uh, cool to be around. Yeah, they know how to pull a crowd. But I think maybe that's it for this video. But thanks for watching. Big thanks to the Petron crew. And we'll see you guys next week. See you then. Bye.